Welcome weather enthusiasts to the weather forecast for the United Kingdom over the next 10 days. Before delving into the details, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and enable the notification bell to stay updated with the latest information. In the latest development in the UK weather, there are four days remaining for the continued strong dominance of the Azorean high-pressure system over the kingdom. This period spans from tomorrow Tuesday January 9th to Friday January 12th. Rain and snow will be absent across the kingdom during this time, except for some expected light rain in scattered areas, which we will identify shortly. However, the weather will be cold with low temperatures across most regions on Tuesday and Wednesday. A slight increase in temperature is expected on Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, especially during the daytime. Temperatures will then start to drop again starting from Sunday, January 14th. Here are the coldest areas in the early hours of tomorrow Tuesday morning, where temperatures will drop to 5 degrees below zero in Carbridge, Nethy Bridge and King Craig. 6 degrees below zero in Aviemore and Glenmore. 3 below zero in Tom Otten. For degrees below zero in Grand Town on Spey, King Ucy, and also Dalwynny. 6 degrees below zero in Braemar. 3 below zero in Fort Augustus, Fort William, Balachulish, Gleanelg, Stromfury, Shieldaig and Ullapool. For degrees below zero in Aknashan. And 3 degrees below zero in Brecon and Clandrindod Wells. Dear viewers, the weather for tomorrow Tuesday will be generally stable with clear and sunny skies in England, Wales, Northern Ireland, and southwest Scotland, occasionally with a few clouds. It will be mostly cloudy in the remaining areas, with relatively strong wind gusts reaching up to 60 km per hour in central Wales and some areas in northern England, possibly extending to the southern coastal areas of England. Now, here are the maximum temperatures for Tuesday in some regions of the kingdom. 6 degrees in Lerwick, 1 degree in Thurso, 5 degrees in Port of Ness and Skarinish, 4 degrees in Balavanic, 3 degrees in Aberdeen, 1 degree below zero in Inverness, 2 degrees in Glasgow, 3 degrees in Newry, 4 degrees in Douglas and Liverpool, 5 degrees in Hull and Sunderland, 2 degrees in Birmingham, Bristol, Plymouth, and 3 degrees in Norwich and London. On the upcoming Wednesday, the sky will be mostly cloudy most of the time in most regions, except for South England, which will experience sunny weather throughout the day. Some very light rain is expected in the north of England and east of Scotland. The weather will remain cloudy across most regions of the United Kingdom on Thursday January 11th and Friday January 12th, with a slight increase in temperatures, especially during the afternoon. Additionally, an Icelandic air front will lead to light to moderate rainfall during Friday evening and night in the northern half of Scotland and the Northern Isles. Dear viewers, anticipate the retreat of the high-pressure system and the movement of the Azorean High away from the United Kingdom starting Saturday January 13. This is due to the influx of a low-pressure system accompanied by a very cold polar air mass from the north, resulting in snowfall during Saturday evening and night in the northern half of Scotland and the Northern Isles as well. During the period from Sunday January 14th to Wednesday January 17th, this polar air mass will continue to move towards the United Kingdom. Consequently, temperatures will significantly drop across most regions, with snowfall expected in most Scottish areas, the Northern Isles, and possibly even the Western Islands, as well as Northern England and Northern Northern Ireland. Some snowfall may even reach Northern Wales. The snowfall will be more intense in Northern Scotland and the Northern Isles with accumulations potentially exceeding 20 or 30 centimeters, some rainfall is also expected in most regions. Now, here is the snow accumulation over the next 10 days, between 10 and 40 centimeters in the following areas, Thurso, Melvick, Betty Hill, Derness, Kinlochbervy, Lochinver, Scurry, Ullapool, Paulbane, Laid, Gairlock, Agnashan, Shieldaig, Fraserburgh, Gardenstown, Macduff, Portsoy, Cullen, Bucky, Midby, Stonerbreck, Tobe, Bray, and Baltasound. Between 5 and 15 centimeters in the following areas, Ripondon, Meltham, Diggle, Todmorden, Rillstone, Grassington, Kettlewell, Orton in Ribblesdale, Lofthouse, Pateley Bridge, Ascarth, Leyburn, Hawes, Reith, Gunnerside, Richmond, 
Barningham, Melsonby, Barnard Castle, Kirkby Stephen, Bruff, Baldersdale, Middleton in Teesdale, Stanhope, Bishop Auckland, Darlington, Crook, Cockfield, Northallerton, Middlesbrough, Botton, Rotten, Whitby, Scarborough, Alston, Keswick, Ambleside, Shap, Moffat, Carsfyan, Cummock, Girvan, Eyre, Stranra, Loch Gilphead, Beaumont, Scalisag, Bunessen, Tobermory, Malaig, Skarinish, Vatasay, Balavanic, Ardroyal, Stornoe, Port of Ness, Stromfurry, Fort William, Fort Augustus, Rosehall, Kinbrace, Wick, Kirkwall, Elgin, Turriff, Dufftown, Peterhead, Aviemore, Grantown on Spey, Tom Otten, King Ucy, Dolwyny, Drumnadroshit, Tomich, Ballacastle, Coleraine, Armoy, Lofgyle, Cushendun, Waterford, Dervok, Ballymoney, Bushmills, and Port Stewart. Less than 5 cm in the following areas, North Wales, Liverpool, Manchester, Sheffield, Macclesfield, Preston, Lancaster, Burnley, Cudworth, Settle, Leeds, Ripon, Kendall, Millam, Penrith, Workington, Silleth, Carlisle, Hexham, Sunderland, Blythe, Annick, Horsley, Bridlington, Horick, Langholm, Galashiels, Dunbar, Edinburgh, Armadale, Lanark, Newton Stewart, Dumfries, Glasgow, Greenock, Aberfoyle, Creef, Stirling, Killin, Inverere, Pitlochry, Oban, Lochraza, Camp Belltown, Balleta, Old Meldrum, Aberdeen, Braemar, Portree, Limavady, Dungiven, Magera, Ballymena, Ballaclare, and Larne.